This program is brought to you through the support of the following sponsors. A very pleasant day, friends, and welcome to another edition of Auto Review. I'm Ron de los Reyes, and today I'm coming to you once again from the SMX Convention Center. This is the home of uh, motor shows and auto saloons, and today we're bringing you the opening of uh, the Manila Auto Saloon 2022. This is already the 14th edition. This is combined with another long-running car show, the Sport truck show. It's already on its 27th year. They have a lot of interesting displays and I notice that uh, they have uh, displays of rigs, cars and, uh, and pickup trucks with roof tents. This indicates that uh, people are interested in the outdoors and they want to go camping. Before I go on to all these, let's take a look at the latest in motoring on our auto news update. Toyota Motor Philippines or TMP offers special deals for its wide range of vehicles this holiday season as a tribute to the 12 days of Christmas. 12 Toyota models can be availed through the pay low, pay light or cash savings options. Under the pay low option, selected Toyota vehicles can be availed for as low as 15% down payment, 60 months to pay, free one-year insurance, and three-year LTO registration. The Paylight option lets customers purchase selected vehicles with low monthly plans, 50% down payment, and 60 months to pay. And under the cash savings option, customers can get up to 50,000 peso savings for selected vehicles. Meanwhile, Toyota is also offering free maintenance for every brand new Bios, Corolla Altis, Rays, Avanza, Velos, Rush, Innova, Fortuner, Hilux, and Hi Ace. In addition, a free 5-year warranty will be included with every new BIOS G, E, and XLE variant purchase from accredited Toyota dealers with a coverage of 5 years or 150,000 miles, whichever comes first. To know more about Toyota Motor Philippines special holiday promos, head on to their website. In other news, Hyundai Motor Philippines Inc. officially opened its doors in Roa City in Capiz. This makes Hyundai Rojas the first dealership to be inaugurated under Hyundai Motor Philippines and marks the start of its road to 45 authorized outlets by 2023. Roas is known as the seafood capital of the Philippines. Aside from this, it is also recognized as the cleanest and greenest component city in Western Visayas. The city is committed to ensuring a healthier and brighter future for its residents and visitors. Hyundai Motor resonates with these efforts towards creating a sustainable future 
and thus it aspires to take the lead in providing mobility that benefits both the people and the planet. Hyundai Rojas City is managed by the Ang Group, headed by its chairman, Antonio Tonton Ang. Capiznons can look forward to seeing Hyundai's lineup of new models, including the Creta, Palisade, the Tucson, the Santa Fe, the Staria, and the latest member, the Stargazer on MPB. Hyundai Rojas is located in Barangay Bolo, Rojas City, Capiz Province. Motor Image Pilipinas, the exclusive distributor of Subaru vehicles in the country, is offering special deals for the Subaru XV and Forester. The Subaru XV crossover SUV is equipped with the idle start-stop feature which shuts off the engine while sitting in traffic. This ensures lower fuel consumption by as much as 4%. Another new feature for the XV is its tire pressure monitoring system which gives the driver instant feedback on the pressure of each tire. Meanwhile, the Forester is also equipped with the advanced safety features. Aside from idle start-stop and TPMS, the Forester now comes with driving monitoring system or DMS. This uses facial recognition technology to store driver information. Seat position and climate settings are instantly stored by the car upon setup for up to five drivers. It also comes with EyeSight 4.0 Advanced Driving Assistance System or ADAS with Level 2 Automation. EyeSight 4.0 automates certain driving actions with adaptive cruise control. There's no need to constantly watch their speedometer as well because the EyeSight maintains highway legal limits with its set it and forget ACC feature. Here's our car price watch for the Subaru XB and Subaru Forester. And so goes our auto news update. Auto Review will be back with more. Stay with us. Auto Review continues, and today we visit one of the Isuzu dealerships in the south and this is Isuzu Pagbilao in Quezon and we drove all the way here to attend the fourth year anniversary celebration and at the same time this dealership has adopted the IOS or the Isuzu outlet standardization at uh, dahil malapit na po ang Pasko kita nyo naman ha? ganda ng kanilang Christmas tree and uh, uh, later on, uh, the executives of uh, Isuzu Philippines and Isuzu Pagbilao will light that Christmas tree. On to our Me and My Isuzu. Congratulations, um, sir, and uh, this is a big celebration, your fourth uh, anniversary, and uh, what other events are you observing uh, today? Our event for today is all about Isusu Pagbilao's Quezon's fourth anniversary celebration. 
and relaunching of Isuzu Outlet Standardization. As you can see, we have a new parcel that looks more attractive and by itself, the masculinity of Isuzu tells all. Thanks for IPC's new philosophy of design that create overall impact on all dealership place and life. Five years ago, this lot is like a forest. Madamo, may tubig, maraming kugon, but after seven months of construction, here we are now. Isuzu Pagbilao is here doing part sales and service. And for the record, for the last, uh, I think, uh, 2020, IPC awarded us uh, as one of the highest in sales when it's come to commercial vehicles, unit received, and part sales. The event was attended by Pagbilao Mayor Angelica Portes Tatlunghari, Vice Mayor Shiera Ann Palipik, Isuzu Philippines President Noboru Murakami, and other IPC executives. Established in 2018, Isuzu Pagbilao caters to a diverse customer segment from different businesses, transport cooperatives, and individual customers. And yet they manage to strengthen their relationship with each segment, enabling them to secure 13% of the truck market in such a short time. And we are very proud of this achievement and the leadership they have shown, especially on the track market. We are here at uh, Isuzu Pagbilao because they are celebrating uh, two special events for today. First, uh, they are celebrating their four years uh, anniversary. So we would like to thank Isuzu Pagbilao for uh, their support in providing the best transport and business solution to the people of uh, Quezon province. And number two, they are uh, relaunching uh, their new dealership uh, under the IOS program, which is to bring uh, outmost customer success here in the area of uh, Quezon province. Itong lugar na ito ay talahipan. Apat na taong singkad. Ito pong mga gulong na dinala ninyo rito na laging sasakyan. Maraming pinagbago, inyo pong pinadali ang buhay ng bawat pagbilawin. Mas madali ang pagpunta sa trabaho, pagpunta sa eskwelahan, mas naging mabilis ang pagdinegosyo. At binigyan niyo po kami ng pagkakataong mas maraming oras para sa pamilya. Higit sa lahat, ang mga gulong na dinala ninyo rito, nagbigay po ng changes mabilis na pagangat ng buhay ng pagbilawin. Mr. Tolentino and Mr. Murakami also did the honors of lighting the huge Christmas tree at the dealership. Isuzu Pagbilao also displayed classic 1983 and 1985 Isuzu Trooper, 2000 Isuzu Fuego, and current vehicle models. Wow! Galing! Okay, what you hear is the engine of this uh, 1983 Isuzu Trooper. So ito, uh, galing pa ito ng Japan, di wala, wala pa kasi yung Isuzu Philippines, CBU Japan. Si Japan. 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 number, it's J8, Japan. Malubag din, ha? Kung mga babasa natin, sir, sa ORCR, it's indicated there, wagon type. Wagon type, ah, okay. Like Isuzu Grouper, wagon type. Yeah. 
to Isuzu Pagubiro. Congratulations on your fourth anniversary and for the relaunching of your new iOS dealership. And to all the televiewers residing in Pagubiro, Kesong. Thank you so much for supporting the Isuzu brand. Thank you very much. We'd like to invite all the uh, televiewers, especially those who are residing here in Quezon area, to visit Isuzu Pagbilao and check their latest products and after sales service. And then you may also visit our website at www.isuzupil.com and our social media platforms to know more about our promos and uh, events. Thank you very much. Congratulations to Isuzu Pagbilao and Isuzu Philippines Corporation. This dealership is celebrating its fourth year in the business and also adopted the Isuzu outlet standardization. Auto review will be back. Stay with us. Welcome back to Auto Review. On our special feature, we go to the SMX Convention Center for the staging of the four-day Manila Auto Salon and the Sport Truck Show, two of the longest-running car shows in the country, especially the Sport Truck Show, which is now on its 27th year. Happy because I think this is their they're so hungry to show their vehicles because the pandemic two right. years although I had a show last year but it was a smaller version because it's a still pandemic so this they're back in other words yes. so they're back and they're so excited to show their vehicles I have about 150 vehicles here competing uh, you saw a lot of trailers like the campers and everything it's all recreation I think also because of the pandemic they, you know, love to uh, go out of their homes, uh, sa mga provinces, and go camping. So I guess, uh, you know, it uh, gave birth to all these uh, trailer homes, these overland uh, vehicles with, you know, uh, accessories for camping. So very, very interesting, actually. Concept one, and uh, yes, uh, very exciting display here of method, uh, black rhino, and vehicle tires. Tell us more about it, uh, Sam. Uh, so, Ron, we're uh, this year we're launching our first time we debuted method race wheels at the Manila Auto Salon and the Sport Truck Show. So, we're featuring the new lineup of um, method wheels from the USA. Uh, method race wheels is very uh, popular in the United States and uh, we've specifically dressed up three Toyotas here, the FJ of Jack, Jack episode, uh, the Land Cruiser LC200 and this uh, Hilux of uh, Tonton Liave. Black Rhino keeps on coming up with new, our, uh, we're also featuring the, the latest designs of Black Rhino and uh, we pair them all with uh, Nito tires because we've been selling them since 2003 and uh, we're very, very happy with them. You know, 
uh, overlanding, what we want to uh, show everybody is overlanding is not just for big SUVs. Yes, that's the norm. And uh, there's this big tre trend on slamping. So with your wagons or with your you know vans, right? There, there's a big trend on that. And you know us, we thought that why not do it on a Porsche? Uh, the Porsche is a, it's a Carrera 4, so it's all-wheel drive. So and uh, it's been done before, and we have an inspiration from the U.S. With, uh, I think the Porsche Dakar, the Porsche that recently launched that, and that was one of our inspirations of doing that. So with 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 that in mind, I think we were able to produce the probably the first overland Porsche in the Philippines. You know, overlanding with the pandemic and all that, people need to go out, and one of the best ways to experience nature and our country and to explore the Philippines is through overlanding. Uh, we have so many beautiful islands. Um, and uh, at the end of the day, that's one way to travel. And uh, being able to do so in comfort with the roof tents, with the freezer system, with the water system, that's just our way of executing a travel lifestyle that's uh, sustainable for, I think, the Philippines. Or what's new? Clean Fuel has opened new stations back-to-back -back at Katipunan, Quezon City, and C5 Bagong Ilog in Pasig. Attorney Bong Santay said they are thankful to have found a strategic place along Katipunan Avenue in White Plains, Quezon City. The move is part of the company's expansion to bring quality fuel for less to as many motorists as possible. We're here at Clean Fuel White Plains Avenue, uh, the newest addition to the Clean Fuel family. Uh, at the outset, I just nais ko magpasalamat sa lahat ng ating motorista who was uh, allowed and uh, powered Clean Fuel in our continued growth. So all throughout this year, nagpapasalamat kami dahil, dahil sa mga ating mga motorista, sa ating mga customers, patuloy na napalaki at napadami natin yung Clean Fuel. Ito, we're very happy to be here at uh, Clean Fuel White Plains Avenue. Matagal ko nang Talagang inaay itong uh, lugar na ito. Pero for the longest time, wala akong makita dahil punong-puno itong stretch na ito. And then we were given this opportunity to, to, to have found this uh, perfect location in uh, along White Plains, Plains Avenue. You know, for the longest time, syempre ang aim namin was to supply motorists with uh, the needed fuel. So nag-concentrate kami in providing, uh, of course, quality diesel, 91 and 95 octane fuel aside from yung auto LPG natin for mga public utility vehicles. Pero, you know, uh, as, as, uh, as time went by, a lot of our customers has been clamoring for a high-octane fuel para daw sa kanilang mga sports cars, sa kanilang mga luxury vehicles. So dito sa ating uh, Clean Fuel uh, White Paints Avenue, we now introduced our race 97 octane fuel. This is the first time that we introduced yung 97 octane uh, gasoline para sa ating mga motorista. Meantime, the much bigger Clean Fuel C5 Pasig also opened this week. It is located along C5 in Bagong Ilog area and is accessible to motorists plying the Pasig to Taguig and the south. VIP cards may also be availed of in the two new stations. Customers may earn points and raffle coupons every time they fuel up at Clean Fuel. And that's our show for today. I hope you enjoyed it. And we would like to thank uh, Sophie De Los Santos of the 
Manila Auto Salon and the Sport Truck Show 2022 edition for inviting us to this exciting car show here at the SMX Convention Center. Until next week, at the same time here on Auto Review, this is Ron De Los Reyes saying thank you for joining us. Drive safely all the time. We'll see you next week. Maraming salamat po.